Hello, this is Faith of Faith and Books, and I'm just making a very quick video. I'm planning way ahead, but I want to, uh, I was wondering if anyone wanted to do a read-along with me of this book, Tarka the Otter by Henry Williamson. It's supposed to be a natural history classic. I bought it years ago. I read a little bit of it and then somehow got distracted, and it's been sitting on my shelf just like this for years. And um, part of the um, Reading One's Own with um, Kelly of Books I'm Not Reading and um, Jason of Old old Blues Chapter and Verse, um, this would be part of that challenge. Um, but I, I think I'd like to read it with somebody because I've never done that. So um, I'm not necessarily a, um, a buddy read, but I've never hosted like a read-along or anything like that. I'm, I'm really new to you, uh, BookTube. Anyway, um, so it's Tark of the Otter, and, you know, I noticed it when I was cleaning through my books in my study, which I've been doing lately on and off, uh, and then I was perusing the uh, New York Review Books site, website, and I noticed they had it, um, and then I, I've recently started watching this other YouTube chase, uh, station or channel called um, I Escape to the Country, and it's like a an American HGTV house hunters, but it's uh, these British, mostly British um, people uh, moving out to the country. And oh, the countryside is so gorgeous and they're moving into these beautiful little cottages and you know, the date from the 1700s and stuff, it's really, really interesting. But one of the episodes, they were on the River Otter. So, uh, so that made me think of this too. So then I thought maybe uh, this would be a fun thing to do if anyone wanted to do some nature reading. Now, I'm a slow reader, and I'm so, uh, things are booking up already, so I'm thinking May for this, because I have nothing slated for May yet. Um, and May would be a good time to do some nature reading, because at least where I am in Virginia, it's an absolutely gorgeous month, uh, where you want to be outside communing with nature, because all the flowers are in bloom, and all the all the trees are green. And the weather is usually nice. So um, so anyway, if anyone is interested in reading along a night, like I said, I'm planning way ahead. I'm not thinking about doing this until May. Um, let me know. Um, it could be fun. So, so that's it. Talk to you later. Bye.